Hey, my name is Aaron, and if there's one thing I know, it's heavy metal. It's time to shirt at the devil. This is the first uh, garment that I ever got when I was 15 years old. It is a uh, Kiss paper jacket. I put it on one time and ripped the armpit out of it. Check out this Black Sabbath 1983 tour shirt. The sleeves are cut off. Seen better days, but well-worn metal shirt. Here's another Shout of the Devil. This is a classic from 1983. This is a three-quarter sleeve. You can check out the back. It's official, 83-84, Shout of the Devil. Three-quarter sleeves with the sleeves and arms ripped out because that was the way to do it in the 80s. Check out the back. What makes this special on the back is it's got the tour dates on here. All the different places went in New York, Los Angeles, Alabama, all the different shows. So you know this was purchased at the concert. Speaking of ripped out collars, this is the Sammy Kerr tour shirt from 1986 from the movie Trick or Treat. Remember, Sammy Kerr is a rock and roll nightmare. His fans won't let him die. He won't let them live, whatever that means. Camo sleeve, sleeve print, or no sleeves. As long as it's pre-89, it's all mine. This is not a cool metal shirt. Winger. It's got the tour date, so that's cool. But it does say tour 1990-1991. Any metal shirt pre-1989 is cool. After that, it's not cool. I stick to metal pre-1989. Speaking of not cool, is this Helix 28 years and still rocking your face off shirt. Half alive. It's got a skeleton and a human. And if you look close, you can see that the skeleton has ketchup and mustard on his mouth. Speaking of shirts that are not cool, this one is definitely not cool. And then if you check out the back, Tour 1990-91. It does have the tour dates and some blood on it, but overall, it's not cool. No shirts, no metal, no service, dude. Let's take it back a notch. Check out this Kiss Iron-On shirt from the 70s. Never worn, original 1979 Dynasty shirt. 100% cotton. Let's check out the back. There's nothing on the back. That's amazing. Speaking of Kiss, check out this Vinnie Vincent Invasion Tour shirt from 1987. Look at the back. Vinnie Vincent looking great. World Tour 87 with gold letters. Holy crap, it's a Van Halen Monsters of Rock shirt from Tour 1988. This is actually not a real shirt. This is a uh, bootleg shirt or a parking lot shirt, you would call it. Let's check out the back. On the back, it lists all the bands that are at the concert. Van Halen, Scorpions, Dokken, and Metallica, and Kingdom Come. What you notice about the back of this on the art is it looks like it was drawn with a butter knife. Last but not least, we have a Twisted Sister shirt. This is one they would sell at the mall, stores like Spencer Gifts. Signed by Dee Snyder right here. What do you want to do with your life? All right. If you do the metal math, it all adds up to rock. Thanks for watching, and until next time, from They Actually Made That.